Welcome back. Today is National Dress Up Your Pet Day. If you hear that noise, no, it is not, not my stomach growling because we, we just had breakfast for dinner on the show. This is the adorable Bethany. We found a local pet who always looks so stylish, so classy, a little casual lady right here on Instagram. We have Lindsay, the owner, and Hello. Bethany. Yeah. She is a cancer survivor, first of all, which is yes. amazing. Yeah, Beth is from um, the Pacific Northwest Bulldog Rescue. <gasps> And they, um, when they found her, she had a tumor on her back paw. Oh, so she's, she's like, like, I hate talking about she's it. She's like heights. Oh. <laughs> she's afraid of heights. I'm um, so sorry. And they got her all fixed up and got her leg taken off and adopted out to me. So she's doing great now. So have you all, how long have you had, had Beth? I've had Beth for about two and a half years now. And have you always been putting her in adorable outfits? Um, well, kind of. They weren't so adorable at first, but she's <laughs> temperature sensitive. So she gets really cold easily. So I had to start getting her... Um, tops and um, she also gets sunburnt easily. Aww. So luckily there's a local company in town actually called Gold Paw Series and they make these really cool dry fit um, SPF shirts so we wear these a lot in the summertime. Oh and my then, gosh. Um, there's like windbreakers and stuff that like <laughs> are made for like Pacific Northwest elements. Yeah like so. you know you see on Instagram some dogs they get dressed up in all kinds of crazy costumes which is fun but Bethany just likes to be a regular kind of casual, yeah, just casual wear. Portland lady yeah. right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Does yes. she have any plaid? Um, yes, she does. Well, she's wearing her plaid. Oh, yeah. Oh, of course. Obviously, yeah. <laughs> but like flannel, she, Yes. You oh, know. yeah. Oh, mm -hmm, yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. We did, a, we did a thing out at a farm recently, and she wore her flannel and looked great. Now, it's I don't think good. I've ever attempted to put an outfit on a dog, but in honor of National Dress Up Your Pet Day, could I try to dress yes. up Bethany? Yep. Please do. Oh, my gosh. She's like, what are you going to do? So I should there hold her, right? Well, that's helpful. Hi, Beth. Hi, Bethany. How are you doing for National Dress Up Your Pet Day? She's like, I don't know. I don't want to be here. I'm crazy. Is she, like, camera shy when you take pictures, or does she totally just pose for the camera? Uh, depends on her mood. She might look at me, but it's mostly, like, cursing at me with her eyes. Mm -hmm. um, or with her sounds. Yes, Or but sometimes if she's had enough, she'll turn her back. To me. Should I put the outfit just over this one or should we take this no, one I off? I think you should take it off. Okay, we'll take this one off. Oh gosh. Now when you Full put effect. do the outfit, Lindsay, how long does it normally does it normally take to to swap her outfit when you, you know, the owner who knows what she's doing? Um I a couple seconds, I guess. <laughs> like already you, done you by now. Be, you can just toss. You just toss yeah, it? Oh my gosh. Okay. I'm sorry, Bethany. Oh, there you go. Oh, there you are. Okay, okay, good. You can see again. See, there's the camera. Oh my gosh. I'm sorry you're naked. I know. Inappropriate television. It's okay. We'll get you your outfit on. So now go over. Oh, I think I'm gonna go for this fancy one. This is like a yeah. fancy New Year's outfit, you yeah. said? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Now sometimes you put Bethany in wigs. What I does do. she think of wigs? Um, she just kind of gets still and doesn't move. Oh, so it works good for the camera. Oh my gosh. Okay, here we go. Yes, there we go. Amazing. Nice. Yeah, the wigs are so fabulous and wonderful. Do you know what outfit like is her favorite? Is there only one that she just puts on and she becomes a, a new lady? Um, no, not really. <laughs> Look at that one. Oh my our gosh. Fur, our, our jackets with the fur collars, I feel like she has a little extra pep to her step when she wears, but other than that. Lady with the like fur. Mm -hmm. yeah. Gives her like a nice fur coat, mm -hmm. even though mm -hmm. she doesn't have a very fluffy one of her own. Okay, Bethany, you look beautiful. You look fabulous, darling. Now, any tips for people at home, like Zach over there, who was just bouncing an egg uh, a couple minutes ago on the show. He has a little dog. Do you ever dress up your dog? Yeah. Yeah? Okay, so any tips for people that want to get their dogs in some, some new lovely outfits? Um, well, one of my favorite local places here in Portland is Hip Hound. It's on 23rd, and they have a lot of like really great clothing um, that we have. They have the Gold Paws, Canada Pooch, uh, two of our favorite brands there. And I think those are always a good place to start because they're stretchy, they're easy to get on, you can machine wash them. I love it. So stylish, so handy, and actually functional. Thank you so much, Bethany and Lindsay. You can follow Welcome. Bethany and Lindsay, of course, at Pardon Thy French on Instagram. You guys have over 150,000 followers already. Yeah, we do. That is amazing. Thank you so much. <laughs> yeah. You look adorable and beautiful, and we'll be right back. <laughs>